a lot of uh, but again I really believe it's because people are emotional and they are they don't really know what it is to be in a fight um, again fighting it's not like you know like a match like again I like the jiu-jitsu jiu-jitsu matches do some matches it's like it's a match there's even like that there is still like some dirty stuff that happened but it's a match in a fight it's a fight like every kind of advantage I'm gonna have on you of course I'm gonna try to exploit it it's a fight uh, it's yeah, this is I, here's something I want to talk about there, there are a lot of folks uh, in martial arts communities across all styles who mm. have this idea of a true martial artist and I think what they really mean by that is is a good person <laughs> yeah. And they will, they will hear a discussion like this where we're talking about exploiting rules or understanding rules and, and it sounds like cheating and it sounds like evil and it sounds like bad and wrong stuff. And they will say, a true martial artist oh, would yeah. never do that. Or a true martial artist acts this way and they, they explain like some idealized version of the code of Bushido that never even existed yeah, in, yeah. in Edo, Japan back in the day. Um, but <laughs> a true martial artist... What, what is a true martial artist, Jawad? Well, the, to begin with, they have to understand like, that martial arts has been made for strong people to beat up uh, more people. It's not like, oh, the weak to defend against the strong, that's bullshit. Someone that trained martial arts usually is strong and you just want to get stronger. Uh, to, well, to be even stronger and beat up more people. That's always been the goal of martial arts. Uh, the Gracies show it quite well when they had Jiu Jitsu. They were going to other uh, gyms, closing the door, beating everyone up. And that's how they became famous. Uh, yeah. All the Judo, all Karate, all the different styles always conflicted against each other because my martial arts is the true martial arts. Everything else is trash. So they had to duck it out. It was not about like. Uh, Ping Pong or Shifumi, Rock, Paper, Scissor. No, it was about fighting and who's going to be the strongest. That's what MMA is amazing. Yeah. And martial arts and martial artists always been driven by the quest of power. It's not like, you know, Zoro defending the orphans and the widow. Uh, it's about power. Martial artists are selfish. And again, you have to be selfish to be a strong martial artist. You have to think about yourself. If you want to be... Uh, to be Buddhist, uh, go in the mountain, uh, live on a rock, and uh, uh, I don't know, pray uh, to uh, whoever divinity you believe, and, and do charity, and like yeah, you you will be like you know a great human being, you will be a great person. But to be a great martial artist, you have to be strong, and you have to win against people, yeah. involving violence. So. I know that's, this is going to upset a lot of people, but... But that's true. That's, Again. The term martial arts in the English language actually originated from, from old English sword fighting manuals. Like, I, I don't remember who was the first one. It was like in the 1600s, I think. But, you know, guys like George Silver, who wrote about sword fighting, mm -hmm. did a treatise on the rapier <laughs> and so on. Like, these are the guys who introduced the term martial arts to the English well, language. And these guys were killers who killed people with swords. Exactly, because martial and arts, martial mean war. Like, yeah. martial, mars, it's war. It's yeah. the arts of war. Literally, a martial artist the is like, yeah, war. it's it's the art of war. And war were fought, like, you know, war is not with water gun and stuff. No, it was sword, it was rocks, it was... And that's that, that's why most of the style before had weapon in uh, included, uh, including Muay Thai. Muay Thai, Muay Boran, they had swords. Like, you know, Krabi Krabong. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, Muay Thai, uh, Muay Boran, Krabi Krabong kind of the same. They had swords, they have weapons. Why? Because they were fighting wars. Yeah. It was not uh, punches and stuff, it was part of it, but all of the ancient martial arts have a weapon in it. Karate, uh, they had... Uh, they had uh, uh, yeah. well, all of the... All martial artists have weapons in it because it was meant to kill people. 